Always good to start the morning with a little swim in Durban Beach front while Carmen does her paddling. Okay, let's hurry. <laughs> okay, let's go. And the biggest challenge is getting changed for work in a parking lot. She's hiding because she knows she has to try and get me to, to renew my liquor license. But it's actually Erica. Thanks, Erica. Pleasure, darling. Liquor license renewals. I'm not a favorite of paperwork myself, but hey, hey, hey. All our ladies waiting for their Uber to go training. <laughs> You're gonna learn something today, ladies? Yeah, we will. <laughs> All about uh, health and safety hygiene. I think the Uber's here. Just in the truck here, checking my stock that's just arrived. Another pallet of porterhouse, another pallet of rump. Hey, and the prices are starting to spike. <laughs> Quick visit to Spark has it in. A meeting with the principal. Luckily we're in the area so we could pick the ladies up from their training. Was it worthwhile? Yes it was. <laughs> they can hardly talk, their mouths are full. Lunch <laughs> on the way home. Oh, oh. Even the fun piece is having something to eat. And we're buying so much meat to keep the prices down while the amateurs are pushing it up. Our biggest challenge is rearranging our cold room so we can fit all of it in. It is insane. And I didn't even realize that Gary here uh, from Chizzy's did a hot mayo sauce. This mayo, what do you call it? Prego mayo. Yes, that's it. That's what we call it. It is absolutely out of this world. Well worth trying. My word. Well done. Thank you. All Shoot. good. I can't believe what I'm actually tasting. This is superb. Goes, goes well with chicken, and I do that, and I, I sell it on rolls as well. And Michael eventually makes some bigger chicken rolls for you guys. I'm sure I can just have it on crackers. It's so nice. Happy days. <laughs> And if you're a spa store and you don't have file directal, Andre here is the man. Look at that. He's even broken his arm trying to get our little office paperless. I cannot believe the efficiencies. Thank you. Mike, it's an absolute pleasure. You can see the lens we're going to to get you more efficient. You know when things are going to go pear-shaped, when you've got the owner of Butcher Boys and probably the leading authority on uh, craft beer and gin having a conversation at Hillcrest Quick Spa and look what's in his trolley. Butcher Boys. <laughs> the story is that his wife said, listen, I'm having a party and I need meat. And he said, well, go to the best place. And here I am. And here you are. <laughs> Because it messes up his maturing cycle, so correct. Let, come to the next best place for your meat. Next best. Yes. There you have it, from the horse's mouth. <laughs> from negotiating lease agreements to negotiating a price on uh, pomegranate. All in a day's work. <laughs> Customers have spoken to me about the price of our eggs. Okay. I think it comes up from time to time, Lee, but I don't, I don't feel comfortable getting involved with uh, those battery caged eggs coming out of the caged egg chickens. At least we, we know the farmer, we know where they come from. Oh, we, we, know, know the... we know the family. Let's just stick to free range and barn eggs. 
Happy chickens, happy eggs. Another crack at this lease agreement. Hopefully, we have another Thompson Hill crest soon. Wouldn't that be fun? Exciting times for me. We're cutting so much meat at the moment. We've had to invest in a new packing facility and traceability facility. So all of a sudden we built out this, uh, this whole camera with overlay system. Any box or any meat that comes into this facility, we tear off the code and we log it into the system like that. And uh, then we of course cut the meat, but when we scale it, it links back to that so we can see exactly where the meat came from. Hey, long day, Lee. Let's get home.